Greetings to all students of class 3. Today in our maths class chapter number 8 measurement we will learn how to measure the weight of different objects. These are some of the packed things available in the market. Let's check their weight dear children. The weight of this packed wheat flour is 1 kilogram. The weight of this washing powder packet is 2 kilogram. The weight of this salt packet is 1 kilogram. And the weight of this turmeric packet is 500 gram. The weight of salt packet is heavier than the weight of Turmeric packet. This is weight balancing machine, dear children. You have often seen it in your schools. Your teacher uses it to measure your weight. As there is no weight put up on this machine now, so the red needle arrows towards zero. When we put the weight on this machine, this red needle moves to a particular number. That particular number is the weight of the object put on this machine. This is electronic weight measuring machine. Now most of the shopkeepers are using it. No weight is now put up on this machine and this is showing 0 kg weight. This number will increase if we will put some weight on it. I have bought a sack of rice. Let's measure it. The weight of this rice bag is 25 kilogram. Let's take one more example. The weight of this sugar bag is 8 kilogram. Next see children. I have bought a floor bag of 10 kilograms. From it I take out 2 kilograms of flour. Now, how much flour is left in this bag? After taking out 2 kilograms of flour, we see 8 kilograms of flour is left in this bag. You have often seen this type of machine with the vegetable sellers. In the one side of this machine, the object which is to be measured is kept in it. On the other side, the weight is kept to measure that object. As there is no weight kept in it, so both sides of this machine are equal. Let's measure the weight of this cauliflower. We have put the cauliflower in one side and that side is bent down. Now we will put the weight equal to the weight of this cauliflower on the other side of this machine. Now see the side with 2 kilograms weight bends down. This weight is heavier than the weight of cauliflower. We see that heavy side of this machine bends down than the lighter side. Let's put some another unit of weight on this side to measure this cauliflower. Now we are taking measuring weight of 1 kilogram. Notice dear children. Both the sides of this weighing machine are now equal. Today we have learned how to measure the weight of different objects with the help of these different weighing machines. We have learned about the addition and subtraction of units of weight. In your homework dear children, you will solve the sums of addition and subtraction given on page number 171 of your maths book.